channel, Battle Leagues, Young Guns fucking tournament. Make some noise to everybody who came out here today. Make some noise for my two models here, standing there in steak apparel fucking clothing. These are some of the shirts that the winner's gonna win, so make some noise for these two motherfuckers and steak apparel. We have our first battle, the first heat. We have Karma versus Weeds. We did our coin flip off camera. I believe Karma has gone first. Yep. Let's kick it off. All right. Any MC that's competing in this, if I battle you, then I could say that I'd easily win. Now what the fuck makes you think that you're better than me? Stepping ahead of these stepping stones and wrecking the scene. If you're attempting to be such a clever MC, why is when my name's getting called out competitors leave? I mean, one day he hopes that he can speak raw. When really you could have sell seashells if you were down by the seashore. He tells himself he's tough behind a keyboard, but I got him committing suicide like he was playing b-ball. I spit a ridiculous rhythm, I got the crowd drooling now You didn't shave your hair bro, you fucking pulled it out After that battle would dissipate, that changed your fate If you've ever heard of a razor blade, it'd probably take a day to fucking shave your face <laughs> Hey yo, this guy likes to taste dudes Cause when it comes to girls, you don't do great I mean, you look for the closest escape routes, just trying to escape routes. <laughs> Time. Yeah. Time. Make some noise! Yeah. Alright. Karma, if I wanted to hear an asshole, I would have farted. <laughs> His favourite question is, can I steal the karma? I got the smarts to spit distinct bars Karma in a golf car trying to spit bars But performing way under par I lost this first round, I bet you won't recover Like Tiger Woods rooting bitches without a rubber Now Mr Collard, you ain't fucking solid I leave you with a blood collar, snot collar, fucking dog collar Eye popper collar, drag you to the RSPCA to confess You killed a duck that wasn't in distress We're playing duck duck goose well, that's your favourite move. Three other dudes, well, that's your crew. Now you're dissing the signal. Signals will be bearing down on you. Signals that have your days like a fairy. Same thing as my mate, days are on the merry. Karma, envision and witness this incision that I'm hitting with precision. I hit you harder than you anticipate, then you're off crying with dissipate. Asking me to participate, but fuck you, cunt. Cut this charade, you're soon gonna see how my fist tastes. Now slow the fuck down, this battle ain't a race. Now go cop, cop a dick, cunt, you're fucking gay as AIDS. <laughs> <Woo! Nice>. <laughs> <laughs> Second round of karma. Hey, hey. I will devour this cunt if he thinks he's got beef, have him laid out just like a drop sheet. Put his remains somewhere in a lost sea. If you don't believe me, come and fucking watch me. I mean, you know that my punchlines are gonna leave you tongue tied, and after this battle, man, you're gonna think, fuck rhymes. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you gonna, you think you're bringing the heat, it will get extinguished. I don't know how you honestly expect to win this. I don't know anyone that respects his shit scripts. On the boat party, I couldn't wait for your set to finish. <laughs> <laughs> I'll open you up like a tin of paint and stab you with some feeling blades as I'm rolling through you'll disappear to make sure your sister gets scissor right. <laughs> yo, yo, I've had enough of faggot fucks always trying to battle us so pack it up your rapping sucks or hack you slap them better up. <laughs> yo, right now I'm about to sever faggots with seven hatchets till your neck is damaged and your head detaches. Torture you with the tools of Inspector Gadgets, bash you with a tennis racket, wrap him up in leather jackets and throw him off the edge of the planet. Yeah. <laughs> you were just a festive faggot and you know that I'm the best at rapping and I know my rhymes fire your brain, but did he just even get what happened? <laughs> <laughs> on. That's nice. Karma, you're trying to be DC's Queen B, but you're Karma, Queen C. Begging on your knees for a big fat D just to score one little E. But you failed this test, you incest pest. The teacher gave you an F on this test. <clears throat> so you had to freaking battle me, right? But you're freaking out because you had to battle Gweeds playing hide and seek like the MH370. Seriously, bud. <laughs> 
17. <laughs> no. So yeah, you're playing hide and seek like the MH370 because you had to battle Gweege. You're hiding, trying to camouflage, call you Karma Chameleon. But you gave your spot away because you started singing Karma, 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 Karma Chameleon. <laughs> so I hit you with an ember, you call me Charmeleon. But in this battle I evolved, call me Charizard. I don't this cunt while I snort a shard. He thinks he's hard, but we know he's soft. If you think you're ill, you better go to the docks. So he'll prescribe you three sucks a day of a doc's little cock. Time. Oh. Right. Nice. Oh. Right. I'm always coming out on coming out on top like of capture rhymes. I'm never falling off my bars. Why you stack his why he stacks his bar? No drugs when I say I will attack his pipes. I guess I've nailed this motherfucker. Passion of Christ. <laughs> I mean, I'll torture you and leave you crucified, so move aside, you don't know what to do on mics. You're full of shit, like a silver pipe. I'm standing out like the moon at night, but then I'm also like the sun because I'm soon to rise. Woo! I don't know why you choose to rhyme. If you ever write in bars and you think that you've gotten better, you need to snap them back into reality and think that you've gotten worse. I'll cut out your tongue, play hide and seek and leave you lost for words. I mean, he probably writes two bars in his pen and pad and think, fuck, what a day. Well my, rhymes are, well, my rhymes are off the chain like a slave that got away. I mean, you're nothing in this game, fuck, what's your name? Call me Pikachu the way that I've shocked this fake. I mean, this guy acts hard, but he's dead on the inside. Him winning battles is I say in that pig's fly. A big lie. You've never heard of a sick rhyme, and I'd say that it's time to end your shit life. And right now, I want to be taking your head, and it's calm, and he's too poor to pay his respects. Last round, Gwigs. This bloke thinks he's clean like detergent. But we know he has a shot of bourbon, starts twerking on a gherkin. Smirking cause he's jerking on his gherkin while he's supposed to be working. I know for certain he fucked his boyfriend behind the curtain. He made a loud noise so I bet you it was hurting. Try to deny the fact he blew too quick like Larry Perkins. Then try to deny the fact he started flirting. But we know you got flirty with the latest craze. His name is Maze Tom Loney. You're a fucking phony, go back and bear back, you're my little pony. You're trying to be a dictator rap, but you ain't fucking Coney. You deserve a fucking headshot like GTA 5 on the Sony. But cut the shit, this cunt's the snitch. He's asking Will Smith for a switch, cause I am legend. This battle's like Iron Man versus Heath Ledger. I'd leave you in a ditch, cause you give a new definition to the phase, calm as a bitch. Make some noise. Hey, yo, it's Creepy J. Fuck Creepy J. Um, yeah, so I've just been uh, taking some notes here. Uh, I actually give all three to. Actually, no, I give the first two to Karma. Um, he, you know, some of that basketball line, suicide basketball line, was shit like awesome in the first one. Uh, I did like uh, Guides' collard lines, that was pretty sick, but I think, yeah, Karma just took that, he just had right, the presence. Uh, Karma's Maltese in the second just wiped him away, like the sever line was awesome, the batter up shit, that was good. Round three, I think Guides just came a little bit cleaner, um, I still think Karma's stuff was better, but it was just like he delivered it a little bit, eh. so yeah, he was, it was still good, but I think he was just, yeah, slipped up a little bit, so um, overall, two to Three. So up to Mars One, just watched the first battle of the Young Guns tournament. Bleeds and uh, Karma. Bleeds was definitely stronger in all three. I mean, sorry, my bad. Karma was stronger in all three rounds, man. He had like multis, he kept falling through his shit. He was confident. He had a couple of pretty standout lines, man. You know, the standing in the moonlight scheme and then soon to rise like the sun. Scissor raping your sister, that shit was mad funny. Um, I will say Gweed's in the third round, man. He seemed to get a bit more confident into the swing of things and definitely came back twerking on a gherkin and the definition of calm as a bitch. That shit was funny as, like, he just needs to build his confidence up, man. But yeah, all three to come. Uh, boom, repping uh, Perth or Perth City Battles or FBL now as well, that's where we are. Uh, we just watched Karma vs Gweeds. Uh, I think the first was pretty close, but I had to edge all, still edge all three to Karma, but the first was probably Gweeds' best round. The I Am Legend bar in the end was probably Gweeds' best bar, but I mean, the fact that he had the big stumble in his second, and I think he spoke more about his crew than his opponent, just um, 
automatically gives Karma the win, so... Battle, the Young Guns Tournament, the rapper who won that, and the guy gone through to the second round, Karma. Destroy the conduct crew. They say, motherfuckers. Blame. <laughs>